slept on the couch tonight. Got home. Ali says I had a fever. And then during the evening, he puked in the bed. Everywhere. Parenting. different rain types here in Gothenburg. We have the regular rain, which is when it rains from above and you get wet and all that. And then we have the piss rain, where it rains from every direction possible. And then we have the side rain, which is, you think you, it rains from above, but it actually rains from the side. And then we have today's rain, which is invisible rain. You don't see it, but you get extremely wet. <laughs> see this here? This is invisible rain. You can't see it, but you get wet. Holy shit. This is, I think, the most I ever filled up my car for. One liter of gas is $2.11. That means I filled up my car for $98.55. That is insane. I am currently on my way to pick up a guest that we're gonna bring with us to the studio today. Hey. Hello. I was so certain that you should come down the stairs. <laughs> How are you? I'm good. How about you? Good, good, good. Now I can actually say this. Leela from YouTube. Oh, shut up. It's just Leela. How many times do I have to explain everyone? Look like it does on video? It does. <laughs> but it is a little bit smaller because yeah. on camera it looks a little bit deeper. Give a grade to the office, like 1 to 10. What would we say? 12. I'll take it. Uh, Okie dokie. We have uh, Leela here as a guest, and I thought, why not have her read the questions for today's QA? So let's dig in. Where do you see yourself in two years? I don't really know. Two years. I want to have a house. That's it. That's everything I know. What do you think of DaVinci Resolve and why aren't you using it? Because I am so used to using Final Cut Pro. Yeah. So for me, Final Cut Pro is so easy to do what I want to do. Jumping into a different program would just mean that everything that I do would take longer. Mm -hmm. I know that you saw me editing. You were like, oh no, I'm never using this, but I <laughs> yeah. love it. And I have no intention of like <laughs> switching. switching. Who is your biggest inspiration? I would say Arnold Schwarzenegger probably is the biggest one. Okay. Um, mainly because he had such a huge impact on me when I was doing the bodybuilding. Mm -hmm. And the mindset that he has is something that I admire a whole lot. So you have another chance. Who are your favorite content creators on YouTube? Of course, Leela. She's, she's the best. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> now, you're very good at what you do. Aww. And uh, if, if I were to say like someone that made me want to start my channel. Of course, that's Peter McKinnon, Casey Neistat, Lita. <laughs> <laughs> well, I actually started a YouTube channel after, but okay. you're okay. just... No, you're you're I'm saying just too kind. That you're just like yeah. So Lila is my favorite YouTube creator. But so now that we have that out of the way, let's talk about my actual favorite YouTube creator. <laughs> okay, let's see what else do we have. How do you set up your camera to get the great audio for your talking head? Blah 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 blah. Honestly, I'm gonna do it like okay. this. You know, I get a lot of questions on how to get the best audio quality from my camera when I'm here in the studio. This is what it looks like. I have absolutely no extra microphone coming down. It's all from this shotgun microphone that I have on camera. That is actually really impressive. <laughs> I just realized that because I thought that you would have like a boom mic or something. Yeah, no. Nothing. That? Yeah. This far? Yeah. <laughs> really? Yeah. Oh my God, I just realized that. That is impressive. It is. But this is the microphone that is like not available, right? Yeah, and it's like 500 euros, <laughs> yeah. but it's very good. How do you find time to edit all your vlogs and regular videos? <laughs> I think that that has something to do with time management, but as you have seen, like editing a vlog can't take a lot of time. <laughs> you, ha you have to do it <laughs> I disagree. Quickly. I take forever. <laughs> If, if you want to be able to do daily vlogs, you yeah. got to make sure that yeah. you have some yeah. sort of system that is going. And when I edit my vlogs, I try not to think about explaining the things that I do, more showing the things that I do and try to turn that in some sort of story 
and also don't overthink the story because it's just start, middle, end. That's yeah. it. One of those things that I am experiencing right now, I know no one is asking me any questions, but here I am interfering or <laughs> interjecting myself. Um, something that I'm noticing, what we just talked about, like what you said about just, you know, bringing people along, that is the key to a good vlog. And I am vlogging right now and I'm noticing that everything that I'm doing is, okay, I'm picking up my luggage, I am doing this. <laughs> and that is what you shouldn't be doing in a vlog. And that is what makes it so hard as well. Um, so yeah, if, if we get to Peter's level, then I think it might actually be easier. Vlogs require practice. So it's not like something that you all of a sudden is good at. Yeah. It requires a lot of practice. And once you practice, that's when you become good at it. How to be consistent, any advice? Make sure that you enjoy what you do. How would you start making videos if you don't even have your own room? You have a room, use that. I started my first YouTube videos in my kitchen. Uh, can you recommend a whiskey? Aberlour, Abunda, I think it's called. I think it's 12 years old, 62%, something like that. Fantastic whiskey, single malt. Can I meet you in Gothenburg? Depends. There's a lot of questions about how do you stay motivated? How do you stay motivated in the beginning? Um, yeah, stay... What is your best tip for starting YouTubers? Again, I think we scroll back to the entire having fun part. And if I look at myself, what I really felt when I started YouTube was the incredible empowerment of learning. When I picked up a camera, everything that I did could always be better. And that kind of like pushed me to become better at the craft that I did. Mm -hmm. I think that if you enjoy the things that you do, if you enjoy working with the camera, if you enjoy doing videos, then that in itself should be the motivating factor to you to make a YouTube video. Listen to this man. Oh my gosh. Yes. Oh, there's one in, uh, in Swedish. Do you want to do that one? Can't you try? Please read it. Please, please, please. Try reading this. Did for a girl Okay, okay, okay. We're just, we're just gonna... Is that... Do I sound like that? Did <laughs> You prepare with like a singing voice. I would say like this. Det vore guld med tips på vinstan i mikrofonen. Använd det dead cat med minnen utom en stad. Det visar det där det där. Han like that. Alltså vill du säga. Det vore guld med tips på min. Okay, with that question we're going to end this Q&A. Thank you to all, all of you that chipped in. Thank you Lila for reading the questions and I will see you tomorrow.